So the first thing that um, is really important is to have an energy elixir, right? We don't call it something that sounds sexy enough. <laughs> we call it an energy elixir, right? Because if you pick up something and you say, this is my energy elixir, oh, right away you want to drink it, right? This is my elixir, it's going to give me more energy. And it is absolutely true. So some ingredients that we're starting with here, we have greens, obviously. What, what are the benefits of greens? Anybody? Calcium, magnesium, living food. When you eat living food, you too become living. Yeah? Inside here, we have chlorophyll. Great detoxifier, builds your blood, lots of oxygen. Liquid sunshine is encapsulated in every cell here. So what you need is a great blender. You can start off with a bartender's blender, like an authorizer blender, that will work. And then you're going to upgrade to a Vitamix blender or a blend tech. The reason is it breaks open that cell wall so that you can get more nutrition, so you can get the liquid sunshine that's inside. Ignorance is bliss for three years, I didn't know. I used my Osteriser blender, it was great. Then I had something out of the Vitamix and went, mm, yum, that was great, wonderful. So, that's what we have here. <laughs> okay, yeah. So we're using spinach. What other kinds of greens could you use? Kale. Kale, Kale. yes. Collards, chard, yeah. All delicious. Romaine lettuce, amazing. Really refreshing. If you use kale, kale's a little bit bitter. What could you balance with it? You could put some carrots, and anything bitter will balance, uh, anything sour will rather will balance the bitter. Look at all these greens. It's just crazy. <laughs> That's what you have. It's delicious, right? So I want to show you that it can be delicious. You will have consumed all the greens you need for the entire day. Probably what most people consume in two weeks, right? In the morning. So you'll say, yes, I've already consumed all my greens that I don't have to drink anymore. And then, guess what will happen? You have to start drinking more <laughs> because the pressure's off, right? So that's good news. And also you set up your palate in the morning for what you want for the rest of the day. You eat chocolate in the morning, you're going to want chocolate for the rest of the day. Obviously. And that's okay. But first, you're going to start with an energy elixir. So we have four cups tightly packed. Okay, this and our water. So four cups of water. If you're using the bartender's blender, please blend your greens and the water first. Yeah? Why? If you add all the ingredients in at once, you will have a chunky elixir and you won't like it. So the idea is that you're going to love, love, love your elixir. You're going to get up in the morning and say, oh, where's my energy elixir? I can't wait to have it. Yes? And it will happen. So. I'm feeding you rotten bananas. <laughs> wow, we come to this in the class and spend all this time and family weekend and everything and get rotten bananas. <laughs> Why? Why are these bananas the ones we use? They're sweeter. Yes. They're right. The bananas are right. They have spots on them. And the spots on them that says that they are right, the enzymes are there for you to digest them. When they are not there, they are unripe, and you have gas and bloating, and they don't feel good. They are a starch. So they're not a carbohydrate. It's more complicated. So first thing in the morning, keep it simple. It's breakfast. You are breaking a fast, right? So keep it simple. All right, so that's what we're doing here. We have three bananas. And usually they're less expensive, too. So you can say, do you have any bad bananas? <laughs> we had Nestor's Market give us 19 pounds of bananas. So we made some smoothies for some people in the streets in Vancouver with half of it. We used half for the cats. It was really fun, do you know? So. All right, so we have three bananas, and then we have some dates. And the dates are medjool dates. Those are the big, red, juicy dates, and they are safe for people who have diabetes. Oh my gosh, now I think I'm really crazy. Bananas and dates. <laughs> but why is that? They have a special fiber in them called beta D glucan, and that slows the release of sugar into the bloodstream. Okay? So versus say agave nectar, which they say has a low glycemic index of 35. Just be really careful and discern through the information that you're hearing because agave nectar with an index of 35 and a banana with a glycemic index of 76. Do you think the banana is more dangerous and the sugar gets into your body faster than liquid agave? No, right? So we know lipids process faster. So glycemic index and glycemic load are things that have just come up in the most recent years, like 83, 85, 87, they worked on it in 1990. So it's pretty new. So there's something
something called the glycemic load, where they actually take into consideration the fiber, the fiber that's in the dates, the fiber that's in the banana, right? And how it processes in the body. So think about that. Okay, so we'll put the dates in. That's for sweetness, if you want. It's nature's candy. Okay. And we're going to close. So we put in three dates. Three dates. And then we have spirulina. So um, I know a couple of you have had wheatgrass before. Yes? So this is spirulina. It has seven times more chlorophyll than the wheatgrass. And it also is blue, so it has an anti-inflammatory effect. It's really high in protein. And it's one of the first foods on the planet. On top of that, it has the same chemical that's in chocolate, PEA. It's that amine family. And it's called the love molecule. That's why you feel so good when you eat chocolate. That's in here. And this is one of the first foods on the planet. That's a pretty sweet story. Yeah. So, okay. How much are you going to use? A teaspoon in the whole jug. Go slowly. My triple type A personality says, more is better, more is better. So I did three tablespoons. I spent three days in bed. I was super sick, right? It's very detoxifying. So go slowly. As the toxins are released, give your body a chance to process them. Okay? So I'm just saying that because it told me to have that same experience. <laughs> Okay, so here we go. I'm putting the lid on the Vitamix. So make sure you listen for two clicks. This is not this is not sarcastic. We have redecorated the ceiling many times. <laughs> not this one. It's pretty high, but at this video. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna taste it and make sure it's okay.